Hi, this is Ozing. Today, I would like to share the proof of this identity. As we can see, the left hand side with bigger anger. So, we will prove from the left hand side. So, 4 is even number. So, we can think, can consider double anger identities. So, tangent 2 theta should have this. 2 become 1. So, which means that half. If we have left hand side, which is tangent 4 theta, when we take half, which means that we should have 2 tangent 2 theta over 1 minus tangent square 2 theta. So 2 theta is again double angle. So we can make use of the double angle formula again. So we have 2 tangent theta over 1 minus tangent square theta. Same thing go to the denominator, we have 2 tangent theta over 1 minus tangent square theta. Remember, we have square here, so we need to square this term. So what we have to do here is, we standardize the denominator of this denominator. So 2 times 2 is 4. 4 tangent theta over 1 minus tangent square theta. The whole thing will over 1 minus tangent square theta square because we have square here minus 2 square is 4 tangent square theta. The whole thing will over 1 minus tangent square theta. The whole thing square. So this is A over B over C over D, which means that we should have A times D over B times C. From here, this is 2, this is 1. So which means that we have a square over a, we should obtain a. So we have 4 tangent theta times 1 minus tangent square theta. Then over, this one is being eliminated no more. Now what we have to do live is just expand this part. So we have 1 minus tangent square theta minus tangent. So 2 tangent square theta minus minus plus tangent square times tangent square tangent power 4 theta then we have minus 4 tangent square theta so which means uh, we will have 4 tangent theta 1 minus tangent square theta over 1 minus 2 minus 4 minus 6 tangent square theta plus tangent 4 theta. As we can see, this is exactly the same as the right hand side. Then we done. Okay, that's all for this video. Thanks for watching. Have a like this. See you.